Hello everyone, it's Lara. So this is the final part of my beauty inventory. So this is like perfume, skincare, hair care, and other kind of miscellaneous things. So I thought I would start with perfume. So last year I had 10 and this year I have 10. <laughs> so all of them are the same from last year except for this is a new one. This I got, I just got for Christmas. So I have four body sprays. I have two from Bath and Body Works. I have the Dark Kiss and I have the Dream Bright. Dark Kiss is one of my all-time favorite scents ever. I love that scent. I have two from Victoria's Secret. I have Blush and I have Love Spell Night. I have four full-size perfumes. So I have this Victoria's Secret Warm Coconut Sugar. I have this Love is Heavenly, Oh So Party, and I forget what this one is called. I think it's, is it called Intense? I don't know, I forget. And then I have two roller balls, well technically three, this is a double-ended one. So there's the regular Victoria scent on this side and the XO Victoria on that side. And then I have this one from Anecdote in weekend vibe next is hair care so last year i had 12 and this year i have five so i have two shampoos um this one was in my cupboard and for some reason i had thought that it was conditioner so when i ran out of shampoo i bought this one and then when i was pulling them out for this inventory i realized that actually this is a shampoo so now i have two shampoos <laughs> oh well They'll get used eventually. So they're both from Suave. One is the Deep Moisture Replenish. One is the Silk and Silk Protein Infusion. And then I have this conditioner from the Almond and Shea Butter line. And then I have these two samples from Spa Luxury in the Vanilla Sugar Scent. So I have a shampoo and a conditioner. Next is Skin Care. So last year I had 61 items, and this year I have 14. So I have this Cetaphil face wash, this Cetaphil makeup remover, um, micellar cleansing water from Market Basket, this Lancome toner, this Witch Hazel from Humphreys, an e.l.f. toner, I have two face moisturizers, one from Clinique and one from Estee Lauder. I have a face mask from Milk. I have this Clinique face moisturizer. I have the number seven night concentrate and an Estee Lauder night repair. And then I have these two foil packets from Dr. Dennis Gross. So I did really well on getting my numbers down in this category. Realistically, I only need three things, a face wash, an eye makeup remover, and a moisturizer, and that would be it. So that's my goal for this year is to get this down to three items. For body care, I unfortunately went up in this category. So I had 23 last year, and this year I have 24. Uh, I still have a lot of the Bath and Body Works body washes. I did use a bunch though. I think I used like five up this year and about to be six because this one's almost done. I don't, maybe not quite this year. It'll probably be the beginning of next year, but I did use a bunch, but somehow it went up by one. Anyway, one of the new things that came in or two of the new things that came in were these two body washes. I just got these for Christmas. So I have the Winterberry Wonder Scent and the Dream Bright Scent. I have Frosted Coconut Snowball, Vanilla Bee Noel, Pink Berry Clouds, Japanese Cherry Blossom, Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte, Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin, Champagne Toast, Christmas Cookies, 
warm sugar or warm vanilla sugar love cotton candy champagne gingham sunrise woods and fresh sparkling snow I also have this bar soap from Yardley I have these two samples from the spa luxury brand in the vanilla sugar scent I have the body wash and the body lotion I have this body lotion from Bath and Body Works in the dream bright scent I have this baby oil I have a hand cream from O'Keeffe's I have a bath fizzy from Bath and Body Works and then I have these two samples from Paul Mitchell's which I think I didn't count these last year these are things that have been just kicking around the bathroom and they're in currently in the project so I figured I would count them in my inventory so it's probably what is kind of skewing my numbers for this year but that's okay the goal is for this category to go down this year next is nail polish last year I had 33 and this year I have 32 so I have a bunch from OPI I have 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 from OPI I have this random one from China Glaze in Happy Go Lucky I have this random one from Nana Coco in number one fan I have two from Palo Taco one is just a plain black shade one coat black and the other one is Aurora unicorn skin I have these random nail stick on things and then I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight from Essie. So I have Bottle Service, Saturday Night Fever, Jamaica Me Crazy, Butler Please, Bikini Sotini, Ladylike, Playdate, and Nothing Else Metals. So I don't think I showed this category last year because these are kind of like essential nail stuff I have, but I figured I would just show them anyway. So I have these Restore Drops from Sesh B. I have this cuticle remover from Sally Hansen, and then I have a top coat and a base coat from Holo Taco. Real quick, I forgot to mention when I was doing my perfumes that I have three perfume samples. I didn't count these in my inventory last year. I thought I had counted them as, as separate, but I can't find my number of how many I had last year. But it's definitely gone down for sure. I definitely had more than this, but now I'm only at six. And last year I had a category for candles. So last year I had two candles, but this year I don't have any candles. And I'm hoping that number stays at zero because I'm just not a big candle person like I do appreciate when I get one as a gift and like you know that's fine like I can definitely enjoy it but it's not something I think it's not something I would go out of my way to get and there are many other things I enjoy more so yeah that's everything I'll see you next time bye